Hello, it's Sarah. And Maya. <laughs> and today I am, we're watercoloring. Um, I was watching some videos last night and I pulled out my distress markers and Christina Warner has some fantastic tutorials with watercoloring with these and I just had to try it. So Maya's here today while the guys are out fixing the car. We are watercoloring. So my show your hula girl. Put it right over here. And this is mine. And I mean, Maya is six years old and I am 50. <laughs> um, she's just doing what I told her to do and it is amazing. We're having so much fun. The only thing about um, we're using two different techniques. Let's get the other one out. We're going to get our boots image out now. Grab boots, my. Okay. And we're using two different techniques. Um, I'm going to see if both of us are in the shot. This I'll is have boots. To... Yep. Mine doesn't have the line on the shoe. Well, um, I'll f here, I'll give you yours. I'll give you that one. How's that? Let's but see if this is my mom. She let me have it. <laughs> she has the line. But she she did it well on mine, but it just didn't come out on the line on the shoe. Right. So we're gonna do. Um, let me see if we're both in the shot. There's a couple different techniques uh, that you can do. You can actually put the ink onto a, a palette, stamp, a stamp block. We're calling a palette. Yeah. Um, or, and we're putting it over a piece of paper so that we can see the color. We're putting it over a piece of paper so you can see the color if it's not so, like, if you can't see. Right, exactly. Like if it's too light, then you can't see. Yeah, the table doesn't make it show up very well. Or, you can just go directly to the um, image. Yeah. So, I'm, Maya's using the water brush. I've been just yeah, using a, um, a paint brush. Yeah, I don't know where, oh, here it is, it's in the water. So I'm going to show one technique right now. I'm going to use, uh, I like this kind of gold for the hair. I'm going to do gold hair again. Um, do you want to do gold hair? And I'll do brown, yeah, because you did gold, I mean brown last So time. we, I did the brown hair on my Hula Girl and she did the um, gold hair. So now we're switching. Exactly. And the one technique, just go on the lines, right? We did this last time. You just put put the color directly to the paper and we're just putting it where it would be the darkest and we're just on the lines and then when you come back with the water you pull the color into the other areas and it makes it like dark and light yeah exactly it so gives it's it like not highlights just dark and light. right 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 because you don't just want it just like one plain color exactly that makes it more um, interesting to look at as well right Yep. So I am just, I've just dipped my brush into the water and now I'm just pulling that color from the areas that I added it with the, with the water. And it is so fun, right Mai? Yep. What were you saying about watercoloring that you never thought? I thought watercoloring was just plain coloring and yeah. I don't just want to sit here. I thought it would be boring because I thought it was just go just for like a couple minutes or an hour. So I don't just want to start coloring. But my mom said she likes to color anyway. But um, she likes to color because her favorite thing is to craft. Mm -hmm. She told me and she like always crafts this like almost I sure every do. day. Well, I think I Most do. Most of the time she does. I do. I really love it. When she it. doesn't have anything else to do. And what else were you just saying about the quiet? Oh, I like the quiet. I used to like the noise. <laughs> Here, go ahead and your I water. I like the quiet because, like, it's peaceful and quiet. <laughs> it's so awesome, right? Mm -hmm. So, I mean, look how cute this is. This is just the cutest thing ever. It's so different from Copics. The Copics. I mean, they saturate the paper. And you know what else I'm not sure about? This is the um, Strathmore paper. I just cut it into AC, ATC size. Uh, it's just Strathmore watercolor paper, cold press, and it's 140 pound. So I cut this into three and a half by two and a half for um, ATCs. And look at Maya's OMG. Look how stinking cute. 
You can't go wrong. It's just, that is adorable. All right, I'm just making sure we're in the shot. Um, for flesh color, what was I gonna say though? I was saying something. Um, oh, there's two different sides to this paper. So this side is a much, what baby? Sure. I'm gonna do the bow red. Oh my gosh, absolutely. Go ahead, you can start, yeah. This red? Um, yeah. Um, so that time we put the ink directly to the piece. Now listen, don't go too hard because it's a littler, it's a smaller area, so you might want to go to your palette, remember? This is a smoother side and this is the kind of like more bumpy side and I put the images on the smoother side this time, so maybe next time I'll put it on the bumpy side and see what the difference is. Um, so that's that, okay. <laughs> so Maya's just added her ink directly to the piece. I'm gonna put some on this palette here. I wanted to see which one, like, if you wanna that put looks, that there. That is awesome, go ahead, you're just great. If somebody wants to, well, like, if somebody wants to put the color just on the bow, yeah. you could just put it and then put the water, or you could just put it on the palette thing. Yeah. The, um, now you know what happened? Thing. Here, look. You can get it on and Let's then show it. a comparison. Maya's put hers directly to the paper on the lines. Let me see if this is in the shot. Yeah, and I've just put the the ink onto my palette, and then this is a much more um, lighter. Yeah, it's way lighter, and there's no definition. But yours has definition. Like it looks like it's shaded and highlighted. I kind of like that. I kind of do. So I may have to go back in and um, let me see how much time we are. Six forty-two. Um, but I'm gonna just do it this way first and keep it really light. This time, I want and to then see I'm gonna go back and add. Do. Okay, so you're doing it my way this time. Yeah. But which, and then which one do you like better? You have to compare, huh? I think I like the shaded one. I do too. I kind of do too. I'm a heavy hand in general. When I used to paint, I like a lot of color. I like it nice and dark. And oh my god, this is so fun though. I'm enjoying this. Yeah. Are you? Yep. I want to give her a yellow shirt, I think. Yeah. I just ordered Joann's.com. They were, and I'm sorry, my um, haul video yesterday, I said the stamps were 40% off. They were only 30. It's okay. 30% is still good. But the distress markers were 40% off. So I ordered the 16 pack, I think, and it had all, every color was one I didn't have. So I was so excited. Oh my God. That's amazing. Look how stinking pretty. I'm gonna um, go back over mine and... Um, Where's the skin color? Uh, this is right here. We're using, for skin we're using Tattered Rose. It's like a peachy color. And then for her cheeks, I put a little bit of um, worn lipstick, just a tad. Maya, you're like an expert at this already. I mean, Maya, how old are you? Six. And when are you going to be seven? July 26. Yep. Next month. So I'm going to well, go away and come back. Up. Hold on. Um, yeah, Maya's seven. And well, six, but you prefer me seven. <laughs> you're, I consider you seven. Because, look, you don't have to keep putting the lid on. All right, just leave it. Um, anyway. Guys, please don't be afraid to try this. If it's Maya can do it, you guys can do it. Exactly. <laughs> All right, I'm going to do her face. You, you did her belly, but you didn't do her face. <gasps> I know, hold on. I'm just, and don't forget her ears. And I'm doing the skirt purple. Okay, go ahead. Do you have purple? Yeah, look, see what colors we have. Where's purple? I don't know, babe. This is kind of like a purple. You're right. I, I need purple. I think we're gonna get some berry colors in the um in Do the new set. The best here? No, this is it. I only have this many. I'll just use this one. Yeah, that's a purple. It's a it's like a light purple. It might not be. Yes, good. Go directly to um the piece. All right. I've just put her skin on, and now I'm gonna pull it. See, it it's not pulling as well. Um on this side of the paper and I'm wondering if maybe it's just because it's such a light color but it's not uh, now I've gotten it on the outside alright it's not 
Are we cutting these out? No. I mean, if you want, I want to keep them as ATC size. That's and I'm gonna, what I would do. Yeah, I'm going to save them in my binder. What? Yeah. What? I, I collect ATCs, haven't you heard? Yeah. <laughs> All right, I'm going to put cheeks. Thing. Watch this, Ma. You're going to love this. Look. You guys like my thing? Oh, my God. Show it. But you forgot to do, um, I like that color, but it matches her belly. So. Um, look, around. look, cheeks. Look Sorry, at the cheeks. Ooh, under her eyes. Yeah, that's where cheeks are. Look, and then you go like this. These are where your cheeks are? These are your cheeks? Yes. Oh. It's the bottom of your cheeks. You do. I'm a oh, we, we say doofus a lot. I just do it brown. Oh my gosh, look how pink it's getting, her little cheeks. This is our first time doing this, so you can't be so critical, you know? That looks cute. Look at her belly. I don't like it. Well, it's tan. She has a very dark tan. You gotta do her chest and her face, and it'll blend in. I'm gonna do it the look, light color. Look, her cheeks color. turned out cute. I'm gonna do it the light color. Where's the light color? We're at, uh, Where's the minutes. light color? That's it. Let's see what else would I wanna do. I wanted yellow for her shirt. Yeah, and you're keeping it light with the, okay. See, she put the ink on the palette that time. Don't push too hard with the tip of the brush because um, I don't want you to like bend the, um. I'm gonna do like her cheek. I like the yellow, let's see how I. Look how pink her cheeks are getting. Exactly. And you just need to add the, did, did you just use the pink or did you use the skin color? Skin color. I mean the pink. Okay. Look how the yellow pops. That really popped. But I don't want to do it because it's going to match the hair. I'm going to do it. No, oh. no, the skin, no. You got to still do her face. I know, where's the skin color? Here, oh. this is it. And boots. I think her boots need to be, oh, I'm going to do them like this bright blue. I'm doing it this red. This is faded jeans. I'm, I'm going to do it red. Go ahead, babe. First, I have to do her face. Mm -hmm. So, we like the quiet, the peace and quiet of crafting, don't we? Mm-hmm. I know, it's amazing. And you're just, it's like meditation. Do you know what meditation is? No. When you go like, when you do your breathing. Why do you do? <gasps> well, isn't that a way to do it? Yeah, but I just go. All right, this is us. Pop up the gun and show your picture because we're gonna go away. Wait, wait! I need to color the boots. Look, we're wait. not. We're just gonna go away now. You, we can finish no, when we're no, off no, camera. No, no. All right, hold on. She wants to show on camera. We have, oh, you have plenty of time. All right. Yeah, exactly. My man, I am such a good teacher. <laughs> yeah. I am because you're friggin' amazing at this. Like, I can't believe how well you're doing. That's just because you're so smart. OMG. This is so cute. Look at her little boots. I made her boots blue. Let me see. Let me see. So cute. This, these are what the boots look like without the water on them. Okay, show it up a little closer. There you go. So you've just outlined things. So you outline things, and if you want to blend it in, or you could just leave it white if you want. I but guess if so. If you wanted to do it red, you take anything with water, mm -hmm. and you just like. Pull the color in. Oh, MJ. You sure do, my. <gasps> and then it makes like a lighter color. And you know what I got? I actually brought these from up, from downstairs, too. I bought some of my Sakura, oopsie, <gasps> my jelly roll pens. Because you could add, that's it's a glitter? bit wet. Don't touch that. That's quite wet. Yeah, like I think I might go over her shoelaces with like the blue glitter one. And like she'll have glittery. I'm doing the blue. I'm doing the green. Okay, but don't do it right now because that's quite wet. Okay. Where are you putting it? Don't put it now. No, 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 no. Oh, jeez. All right, listen, we got to go because it's uh, 625. All right, so let's 
Are you ready? Can I? We're gonna sign off here. You can. Stop touching it to the wet. You ready? This is us. You should hold up your pick. <laughs> It's not finished, but you know what? Thank you guys for watching. It's Maya and Sarah. Bye.